little thing. Come. What's wrong? Come on. So Milton's being a big baby. As you saw, she did not want to walk when I was walking her. And now all she's doing is being a big baby with dad. She's in a baby mood. I wonder what was the problem. Hey, the, Milton, what's the problem, us? Milton? Too hot? You didn't feel like it? Wanna go back to bed? Look at her. Little princess. You guys wanna hear a lazy idea I just had? I think that we should get two pooch patches for her kid Milton and put them there for warnings such as this. When they don't feel like it? Yeah. When they don't feel like it or when it's going to be raining and you don't feel like it, I wonder if they would go into it. Pooch patch. Hi guys. Um, hope you're all doing well. Well, I'm not used to vlogging with this. So I just got a package in the mail not long ago and I wanted to show you what it's all about. If you saw this morning what we prepared for Hurricane Milton, you know that we like to supplement their diet with a lot of supplements and our favorite, Ferrapet Organic. Dear Dr. Michelle Dulé, she finally released and came out with the Cardiac Supplements, okay? Cardiac and she also has the bladder support. So I'm so excited to try these out. Uh, the bladder support has organic cranberry deep mannose marshmallow root and promotes optimal bladder and urinary tract health. And the cardiac supplement has organic hawthorn berry, taurine, L-carnitine, and coenzyme Q10. Supports cardiovascular health and circulatory function. So there are 60 capsules in here. There is, this one is a powder, so I had asked her how do I do it if I'm using the oil, the probiotics, the joint chews, and then these two, she's, she says to space them out during the day. Uh, we do usually oil and probiotics in the morning, then we do the joint chew as a snack, as a treat, and then I'm guessing the bladder powder could go with their evening meal or their lunch, and then the cardiac support as another treat. So. I'm gonna feed this to them today as a treat and then I'll let you know. But I'm pretty sure they're gonna love them because Kirk and Milton love everything, right? Hey guys. So you wanna hear an interesting fact about Mai? Did you guys know that before being a lawyer, she was even a scientist? True, I'm such a nerd. I'm such a nerd. I have a um, degree, a uh, bachelor's in biopharmaceutical sciences. So. All throughout high school, undergrad, all I did was organic chemistry, physical chemistry, all those very boring things. So when, when I stopped filming, and Andy was like, wow, it's so impressive how you can pronounce those things. And I was like, I know these words. Can you do that again? These are amino acids and stuff. So she was a scientist, and she became a lawyer, and then she dropped it all to dedicate herself to cavaliers. And then, and then... I'm going to become a chef. <laughs> a chef? <laughs> really? I don't know. I like to be a chef. No? Interesting. I'm, I'm going to eat. eat snacks for work because I'm always starving at work. I'm going to eat everything Chef Mike cooks. So baby, how was your day? It was pretty much felt like fr Friday, so I didn't really feel like vlogging the same thing again by fear of it being too redundant. But all I did today was fulfill some packages. Yeah, how do you guys enjoy watching my pack packages for seven hours in a row? <laughs> That's all she did today? Literally, Kim and her, all they did was just Stand there and pack packages. Yeah, it was long, but we're almost all up to date with um, launch packages. So there was all the weekend, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday packages. We weren't done all Friday orders. So there was some of the Friday, some Saturday, some Sunday. We're not fully done yet, but it's coming.
But the good news is some packages that we sent out on Friday already got there today, Monday, oh, fun. from Ontario. So from Quebec to Ontario, which is very, very good. That's impressive, right, Herky? Is that impressive? You look very impressed right now. Is she? No. <laughs> She's the opposite of impressed. So, I don't know if we're up for it, but we have a, a brand new Dyson at home. And it's the V11 Torque. It's like one of their top of the line latest vacuum. And apparently this Dyson vacuum cleaner does wonders wonders for pet hair that's stuck in like couches stuck in carpets and it's been lying around for like that's crazy we've been have so much things to do so many things to do that the Dyson has been lying around for like uh, five days and we've been meaning to like open it with you guys and like really put it to the test and see like how really efficient this Dyson is at picking up dog fur off the couch and off the carpet mainly because everything else it's easy like whatever you plug it in it's supposed to do its job but the thing is the Dyson is really good looking too it comes with its own stand and also uh, its battery life is like about an hour so that's pretty good and so we're gonna put that to the test and we'll see how it goes are you excited about the Dyson baby uh, yes I'm excited to throw out the other vacuum that we have which is so big and hideous I hate it can't wait to throw it out. So some of you might wonder if we have a Roomba why we need a vacuum. But the Roomba doesn't do a full job. It still does like 80% of the job and we let it run a few times a week, maybe almost every day. But you still have to do like some things. So that's why you have an actual vacuum to go into corners, to go on the couch, to go, you know, in areas where the Roomba can't go. Hurricane and Milton, they lose so much fur, guys. Like, so much fur. You, you can find fur in every corner possible of the house. That's why we're going to test out the dice. Okay, you, did you figure out where the mic is on the camera? Oh. I think the mic is here, up top. Oh, yeah? So, Herky, are you excited about the Dyson? Yeah? You think it's gonna do well? You think it's gonna pick up all your fur? Milton obviously is absolutely not excited whatsoever about a Dyson because Milton only likes things that roll. <laughs> right, Mil? If it's not a ball shape, Milton don't care. If the Dyson was a ballson, Milton would love that. Herky is so cute, like I'm just filming her for fun because she's so beautiful. <laughs> is she very videogenic right now? As you say that, she started looking high. <laughs> <laughs> but her fur and the sun is really beautiful. Okay, so I go get the mail and then I come back and he's eating dessert. Okay guys, I'm extremely tired today. My energy is low, so I like to eat sugar before i like to eat my desserts before the actual meal what is this this is something special that my made for my bro brother's birthday yesterday it is banana pudding with vanilla oreo crumbs and that's it so let me tell you what this is if you know magnolia bakery in new york city you know that they are famous for namely their is it focused namely their cupcakes but also their banana pudding and this is the um, recipe that you can find everywhere online for the ban you're disgusting go away <laughs> go away <laughs> stop <laughs> so this is the recipe i found online it's the same recipe everywhere it's super easy to make it's a no big dessert so if you're interested i'll make it i'll put it in the description box below i did modify it because in canada we cannot find vanilla wafers vanilla wafers is not a thing here so I put graham crackers and thin vanilla Oreos instead. It's delicious. Makes me miss New York. If you guys are wondering why I'm eating directly from the platter, it's very impolite, but it's because it's all mine. <laughs> Can I have a piece?
Mmm, it's good, it's good. All right, so, okay, camera cut me off. It's about 6.30 p.m. Herky and Milton think they're gonna eat already, but nope. They have another half hour to go or so. So I think we're gonna open some packages. Okay, so this is better, we just close the blinds. We got a lot of packages today, so I thought we would do a fun unboxing. First package is from a local brand. This is Auguste and Co. And I got some masks. Because now masks are mandatory for Quebec. So I got these cute ones. Look at this design. Very cool. I can go on a leash. This and this is Auguste and Co. in collaboration with two local artists. This is Lisa Jordan. This is Natasha Prévost. Look how cute. And then this is yours. Very cool. Little floral thing. You oh, have to, you have to tie it? Yeah, you have to tie it and then you measure it how you want and then you cut. Cool. Yep. I like this. Yep. Okay, we'll so do that. We have to clean it before. I'm going to do it. Alright, this is Andy's package. We don't know what it is because. You know how you just end up buying so many things online you forget what you're going to receive? Oh my god, finally? Oh my god! Yes, more masks! We bought this like in end of March, guys. Can I have one? Of course you can have one. You have to. You can have anything you want. End of March. Yes, It's finally. about time. These are good because it has like the filters that you can throw out. But we wow. don't have filters, so... We're gonna buy more filters, but at least now we have like five, six of them. Yep, we have these masks with filters. We have these fabric ones. It's a good day today. <laughs> it's a mask life now. It's the new reality of things. Yeah. Let's see these packages. I think this is gonna be clothing. Look at Milton. Come here, Milton. Come here, Milton. Come. You guys see Milton in the back? Come here. Sit here. Okay, since we're unboxing, I might as well unbox at the same time. Okay. So I bought a a riser. Riser blind. A riser for the computer monitor. Cause I keep having neck problems. Yeah, this is such a good day. Sexy. It's a mask. I'm buying masks Sexy everywhere. Mask. These ones are from American Apparel, so. They were a buy one, get one free, so it was great. I have one that's leopard print. Look at that. It's nice. That's funny. I love leopard. And then this one, I think it's a peach one. Milton loves unboxing. Why can you tell you guys eat? Where you guys live? Do you guys have mandatory? Oh, look, an orange one. I love this one. Oh, yeah, tell us below. Where you guys live, do you have mandatory masks? Uh, everywhere now in public. For us, masks were even mandatory at restaurants. So they say that you, when you eat at a restaurant, you go in, you keep your mask the whole time, and then when you eat, you lift it, you eat, you really? do what you think, yeah, and then when you're done, you put your mask back on. Like between each bite? No, not between each bite, but between oh. the meal. Oh. Okay, I got new underwear. Is it glass? Yes, it is. Can't open it. Yep, right on the beard. No, they found her little balls. <laughs> Ooh, I hate unboxing things. Oh, more underwear? Okay, it's just a underwear. Underwear and masks, apparently. Underwear. I guess all these are gonna go to the wash. Rise of blind. Did you guys see that meme that says how to speak with an Australian accent. It says, if you want to say rise up light, you say razor blades. So it goes, rise up lights. <laughs> Ooh, and then last piece, oh yeah, this I have no idea if uh, I'm gonna like it or not. I'm pretty sure, oh, okay, okay, here. Pretty sure it's, these things are final sale, but it's, it was like $14. I just wanted a little summery dress. If you guys haven't noticed, all I'm wearing this summer is little dresses. So, yeah. Me neither. Okay, guys. The unboxing of the Dyson is going to go to another day after all. Okay, guys. You want to go visit our office? Our home office? 
Let's go. I'm gonna have a talk with the boys right now. So how many of the boys here likes to work on big screens? Because my, and I think a lot of girls don't care about big screens. They're pretty happy working on their small laptop. Am I wrong or am I right? Look at Andy's screen. How big is that? It's the ultra wide ones. It's so... It's about 27 inch, I believe. So my was yelling at me because I took one of her craft boxes and been using it as a riser. I hate... I can't say the word riser, seriously, because my keeps laughing in front of rise of lines. <laughs> Look at how much better that is. So now we have this, like so. Much better. It's going to be a real riser. Oh, that's so much better. 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 Yo. And I got this on Amazon. They shipped it prime over the evening. Oh, this is nice. Yeah, it's it perfect. It's like a good height. And like. His 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 base here it was wobbling over this box all the time and it fell all the time. You guys know how many times my accidentally knocked my screen down? Well, that's like, that's your fault. It's not my fault. And you know what's fun about this thing is that you could twist it here to make it higher. To make it a bit higher. Oh, that's fun. So do you want one so that you can edit her game Muslim's video like this? No. My always has shoulder problems because she edits too. Too much. So, do you guys have any advice for her on how to like not have shoulder pains? Because I think she's always like this. You, your finger motion is like a PC user, man. Nobody uses she's a like, this like that with her with her trackpad. Track it's like this all the time. Advice, guys. Advice. Rise oblides. Do you guys like our new mirror? We just got this recently. Um, I bought it on Wayfair. Shipping was pretty fast. I just felt like I needed a decent full length mirror. We have one in the front here, but it's not really full length. We have one in the bedroom and it's kind of like that too. It's not like a full big mirror. So I wanted something nice and I like it here. Andy likes it here. What do you guys think? And by the way, this is what Andy does every afternoon. He just sits there and roasts like a roast chicken. Can't, I can't, I can't do that. So uh, let's unbox and open up the supplements, shall we? So as I mentioned this morning, one of these supplements is the cardiac one. This was the one I was most excited about because Herc and Milton, as Cavaliers, they have fragile little hearts and they're prone to heart diseases. So, I was very looking forward to it. Okay, so here's what it looks like. It's like these powder capsules. Let's see how much they should get. One capsule per 25 pounds daily. Hmm. So if Milton is about half of that, I would give them maybe half per day, just to be sure. So you can either give the capsule like this or you can sprinkle it. Since Herky and Milton have to do, like split a capsule, I might sprinkle it in tonight's food. It says it supports cardiac and vascular health. Let me see if we can focus, hello. Regular heartbeat and normal blood pressure. It's a vegan capsule, no soy, no dairy, no artificial colors, dyes, or harmful preservatives. Taurine is an amino acid that supports normal function of the cardiac muscle. L-carnitine is an amino acid that supports endurance. Coenzyme Q10 is an antioxidant that protects cells from free radicals. Organic hawthorn berry contains antioxidant bioflavonoids that preserve circulation to the heart and improve blood flow. Very interesting. I love this. Okay, so let's see this other bladder thing. To be honest, we will try it out, but most likely not continue it un unless there's another issue with the girls and their or urinary health but for now we'll just try it out Herky did have a urinary health issue before but it's been resolved since then um, so we all know that cranberry is great for urinary tract health so you know that there's cranberry in here sorry I really can't figure out how I want to vlog this um, so there's cranberry in here it says it's a rich antioxidant so cranberry is an antioxidant that helps reduce damaging free free radicals and promotes healthy bladder. d mannose is found naturally in the body and in some fruits and vegetables. The sugar supports normal urinary pH. Then the other things, this other astragalus 
root is a herbal supplement that enhances immune response. Marshmallow root supports a healthy inflammatory response and sting, stinging needle root promotes normal detoxification along with proper pH balance. So, okay, so here's what it looks like. It's a powder similar to the probiotics from Farah that we use. The posology is one scoop for zero to 25 pounds. So very similar to the probiotics. I'm having so much time focusing on this thing. Hello. So I'm gonna give them both these supplements tonight. Ooh, oh, okay, Milton. Okay, it smells good. You're gonna have some at dinner. Okay, okay. Wow, she really likes this. So here are what the powders look like. Let's see, Ricky. Oh, you love it. Milton? Does it taste yummy? Yeah, you love it. So the girls have no problem with these supplements. They taste delicious. Hi guys, uh, I wasn't planning on making anything, but our groceries is only getting here at 8. Not that that's relevant with anything, but I wasn't gonna make anything, but I remember I have some cauliflower in the fridge and I've been meaning to make cauliflower wings for a very long time. So I think I'm gonna whip up some cauliflower wings. I watched a few recipes. It's gonna be my first time making them, but I think I'm gonna go with a tasty recipe. So I'm preheating the oven at 450. I'm gonna link the link to oven how to make this in the description box below. But basically you make a batter, you put your cauliflower florets in there, you bake for 20 minutes, and then after you bake, you um, baste them in your hot sauce mixture, and then you put them back in the oven for 20 minutes for all that sauce to like infuse in your florets, and then you have your wings. So let's do it. Guys, look at all these beautiful fruits and vegetables that Mai just got delivered here. Hey Milton, doesn't it look pretty? Okay guys, let's play a game. Let's play a game called Can Herky and Milton Eat This? Answer by yes or no. <laughs> She's so cute. Herky, can you eat this? What is it? Herky will answer yes to every single Question How about this mini apple? Would you eat this? This is for Milton. Milton would eat this. Do you guys eat kale? Kale. Do you eat kale? Whoa, Herky's eyes so big. How about ginger? Hey, you can't eat it. Sniff it first, see if you like it or not. 
They're so cute. Do you guys eat banana? Oh, for sure you guys eat banana. Banana, good for dogs. But in small quantities only because it is very sweet. Hey, Herx. Onions. Definitely not. You cannot eat this. Onion is poisonous for dogs. This is poison for you, Milton. Poison. I have a feeling we're gonna green juice all this. No bananas. Oh. And he's eating leftover. Do you wanna try my cauliflower wing? Sure. How about I get your first impression of it? This is the first time you make this. Is it deep fried? Mm mm. It's oven. Pretty good. It's not too buffalo. Mm. It tastes junky, but it's not. It's well, it's cauliflower and it has a flour batter, but then this is really good. Oh, you like it? Good. All right, it tastes super junky. It tastes like popcorn chicken, but it's just vegetables. Mm. This is how her feel looks like when she looks like food. Yep, <laughs> but she looks so much cuter than no. you. I feel bad because I show them all these fruits and I give them nothing. You can give them some an asparagus. Okay. Ooh, asparagus. All right, so Andy has some Chinese food leftover that we had yesterday. I have some of the veggies. This is other leftovers. It's some tofu kimchi soup I made the other day and cauliflower. Okay, this looks sad, but it's delicious. It's so good, this chocolate cake. Mm, delicious. My, sis my sister brought me this back from somewhere. And it is so good. Like, look at this, how fudgy and delicious this cake is. And then we happen to have raspberry coolie that I'm just going to finish this cake with. Honestly, these just look like Hercules Milton's food. Mmm. So good. Okay, but I have to enjoy this cake off camera, guys. I'm going to be gross. Say bye bye to your friends. Bye. Thanks for watching, guys. One more thing that Herky cannot eat. Bye friends.